Hey guys, what is up? Welcome back to another episode of VGC Prep. I'm your host Ryan, and today we're going to continue on with this team. I've been debating what item to really run on a Roman Tease. I think right now I'm running Rocky Helmet, which is kind of nice. Um, but I was thinking, you know, maybe, maybe Red Card. Red Card might work. I can switch in on an attack and just kind of like make them switch out, which is nice. Um, but let's look at this team. We've got a Charizard, which is going to be a huge problem for this team. A Whimsicott, a Florgis, a Marowak, a Machamp, and a Venusaur. So let's just assume he's starting off with the Charizard. I'm going to start off with my Rotom Heat. Rotom Heat has a great matchup against this team. Um, and I'm also going to start off with my Melodic, because even though he has the Venusaur... Um, no, actually, wait, wait, let's let's think about this for a second. Let's actually play a little bit safer. Let's start off with Trevin and Scraft. They wrote him in the back, and, um... Melodic. No. Yeah, no, no, Melodic is going to be pretty important here. The reason I'm starting off with Trevenant and Scrafty is because that gives my best ability to get Trick Room up and put myself in a winning position, you know? Um, and that's what we're going to do. That's what we're going to try. Uh, it's going to be rough, but we might be able to get this going. Charizard or Marowak? Oh, okay. Um, that's actually really good for us. This Marowak might have Fire Punch, but I think I can survive that. So I'm going to go for Trick Room. I should underspeed this, right? Or should I just go straight for... Oh, this is a tricky, tricky spot, actually. I'm going to go for Trick Room. I guess, you know, I do have I do have Melodic in the back. So we're going to fake out the uh, Charizard. Um, I have an Assault Vest on my Scrafty, so I should be able to survive a Heat Wave. So what I'm going to do is probably going to switch into my Melodic next turn for my Trevenant. All things e being equal. And we should be able to do some pretty decent damage here. So he's not gonna f he's not gonna protect with the Charizard. We're gonna get that fake out off. What is the Malwak? Bulmerang. Okay, that's good. That's not that's not bad. That's not bad. Oh wow, that does nothing. Oh my god, that does nothing. So I am gonna switch out into my Melodic here because I'm a little weary of the Charizard. Um, but I'm gonna crunch the Charizard anyway. Uh, there's no reason for me to stay in with my my Trevenant. Uh, and there's no reason to go into Rotom because honestly, Rotom's not gonna want to take a soul. Um, a rock slide here. Um, I can ice punch the Marowak, but judging by that damage, it's not a big threat. So I'm just gonna crunch the Charizard, and uh, we'll see what this does for us. Now I can't use electric moves on the Charizard, which is another reason not to go into uh, into Rotom because I can't do anything to it. Uh, and what are we gonna? We're actually probably gonna see Scrafty go down here. Um, I got burn. That's not a big deal. What? What do I do here? Well, let's see. My speed on Rotom is 81. My speed on Melodic is 77. So Melodic will outspeed. Um, so I will bring in my my Rotom here. We're gonna go for Hydro Pump on the Marowak, and we're gonna go for the Volt Switch onto the Charizard. Let's go for the Hydro- Actually, yeah, let's just- Yeah, let's just do it, let's just do it. And the Volt switch onto the Charizard. Oh, he's just gonna straight up switch. Is it gonna be into the Venusaur? Because that would be lovely. Oh no, the Machamp, that's even better, actually. That's even better. Uh, Marowak goes for Bone Mering. Again, it shouldn't do too much damage. Not a lot. A little bit more than I was expecting. But even though we're in the sun, Hydro Pump should take this thing out. And we're probably going to lose our Melodic, actually, now that I think about it. How does that not take it out? What the heck? I know we're in the sun, but still. Well, that's unfortunate. That's so bad. How did... Marowak's not that bulky. Come on. Not that bulky. Alright, well, we have two full HP Pokemon. I'm... <laughs> Not, not too in a bad spot, I guess, um, but I am going to go for the Horn Leech onto the Marowak, and I don't really have anything to hit that Machamp, um, so I'm going to Volt Switch. I don't want to overheat because that that's... Oh, come on, stop with the protecting! 
Oh, I'm being outplayed by a Marowak. Come on, let's go. Ice Punch. Of course it's an Ice Punch. Should I... Oh, that damage was huge. That damage was huge. Why was that damage so huge? Like, I know it has Lightning Rod. I just keep thinking, hey, I'm going to kill it right now. Of course I'm not. I'm going to burn it. I know that's a bad play, but I have to burn it. And I'm going to hit and power ice the Marowak. Is he might have guts. If he has guts, this is gonna suck. But if he doesn't, oh, rock slide, of course, rock slide. Oh, that really doesn't do that much, actually. Uh, and I obviously, since the sun is up, I harvest automatically. Um, let's see if he has guts. So if he doesn't have guts, this won't kill us. He has guts. I mean, there was really, I didn't have a, any other play. I, I really didn't, because I can't use my overheat on the Machamp, because obviously, if I do that, I lose. Um, oh, I don't know what to do here. Has it really only been six minutes? Damn. <laughs> Sun goes out, we're probably going to see, well, Trick Room actually ends. Which is not bad, because that Machamp's slower than me. Um, we're going to see the Charizard. I don't know why the Charizard came in here. Um, I think he's gonna protect, or if he has like ancient power. I'm gonna overheat the Machamp. I have I have a bad feeling about that. Air Slash. Why? Wait, what? Okay, I just don't understand what just happened. <laughs> Air Slash was weird. Machamp's obviously going to go down to that. Now, I'm at negative 2, which is not good, especially if he has the Venus. Well, actually, if he has the Venus in the back, that's not too bad. Because the sun will be up, and I can kill... Yeah, he does have the Venus sword. I wonder if he's going to put me to sleep. That might be nice. Um, so let's Volt Switch this Charizard. I think even at negative 2, I should be able to take it out from here. Maybe. Um, he is going to Sludge Bomb me. That might KO me. It does. Damn it, crit. I think that didn't matter. The crit didn't matter. I don't know what I was gonna do there. That was such a bad game. I don't know what happened. Um, Charizard is a huge threat to my team, but um, it, it's just that Marowak. That Marowak is playing such good mind games with me. Uh, very good mind games. Uh, but let, let's go. We, it's only been seven minutes, so we can get another battle going. <laughs> Ooh, excuse me. Um, oh my God! I can't stop hiccuping. Yeah, let's just let's just get another battle going. That Marowak is such a jerk. <laughs> um, like, oh man, I protect. I, don't, I really that that Ma the Machamp was definitely guts, but what are you gonna do? Um, so it looks like we've got a Sylveon Scizor, Talonflame, Smeargle. That Smeargle's gonna be a, a jerk and a half. Uh, Hitmontop and. A Hydreigon. Honestly, Mawile's a huge good lead. But I'm going to start off with Scrafty and Trevenant. No, wait, yes. Yeah, Scrafty and Trevenant. This Trevenant can survive a Brave Bird at from minus one, so that's why this team works pretty well. Uh, we're going to bring Mawile in the back, because there's really no reason not to bring Mawile. And um, let's go for Melodic. Melodic's going to be pretty solid here. Um, that Smeargle is going to be carrying Dark Void. I think it's going to be a Mega Scizor, if Mega at all. This is the only possible mega. This is the only possible thing, you know. Um, I'm just hoping no Smeargle lead. I mean, Smeargle lead's not too bad because we'll just get Trigger Mom. Hit him on top and Smeargle. That's not too bad. That's not too bad. Um, oh, but are we going to outspeed the Hit him on top? No, we're not. He got the intimidate off first, didn't he? Oh, I wish I saw that. I didn't see that. Okay, well I'm gonna I'm gonna go in assumption that I have that I have the priority here. Which I don't. Yep, no, I don't. Damn it. Now this I have nothing. I, I don't have a switch in for Dark Void. I hate Dark Void. It's it needs to be banned. It needs to be banned. Not even just that it's broken. It's oh! Thank you, Scrafty. Um, just the fact that it completely ignores why they banned event Pokemon, you know, it just didn't make no sense. Um, but we see the attack fall, I wish evasiveness fell. Um, I am going to drain punch the Smeargle just in case, 
and I'm gonna go for trick room just in case but I, I there's nothing I can do here I don't want my mall while to sleep Wait, why would you go for bullet punch that's did so much damage oh my god wait what wait what what was that for that was kind of dumb why wait what what just happened can I get can I wake up can I get a wake up please can I please get a wake up because he just threw that game damn it um okay so he just threw that game so what do I do accuracy drop evasiveness fell that's fine um I'm gonna drain punch again because I'm just hoping I wake up here endeavor was weird um, he's probably- oh, he's gonna Endeavor again. Is he gonna Endeavor my Trevenant? Actually, if he Endeavors, that's kind of fine by me, because I'll just survive. Um, yeah, no, I actually, yeah, if he Endeavors, that's not too bad. Yeah, I'm fine with that, because I'm just gonna kill him here, and then I just- I know he has Bullet Punch, but that's not too bad for me. I'll just switch into my mall while I have no reason not to. Uh, yeah, wait, that, that was that was an odd play. He could have won that just by continuously sleeping me. Um, but we know he has bullet punch. We know it does a decent amount of damage. Uh, we know the intim the mall the hit on top has intimidate. We're gonna see the talent flame. Crap. Seriously? All right. Well, I'm gonna bring in my mall while here. I'm gonna switch out into my melodic. I, I think even at negative two, I can't survive from that range. Ah! All right, oh well. Um, but I, I had absolutely no reason to not switch out here. So we'll see what he thinks, what he does. But um, honestly, even a flare blitz shouldn't take out my mega mall while at negative one. Um, plus we have melodic, so it's not a big deal. We're gonna see the bullet. No, yeah, we're gonna see the brave. Brave Bird, which shouldn't take out my, my Malotic, unless he's like super banded. Um, oh my god, that does so much damage! He's gotta be banded. Yeah, he's gotta be banded. Um, and we see the Mock Punch, again, doesn't do much. I don't know why he went for Mock Punch, why he has Mock Punch. He's probably tech. No, he's Intimidate. What am I saying? We're gonna Mega Evolve here. Um, I'm gonna. Actually, I'm gonna protect, because I'm weary of that talent. Actually, the talent flame is probably gonna take me out too. Um, you know what? Screw it. We're gonna Mega Evolve. We're gonna crunch the Talon Flame because just screw the Talon Flame, uh, and we're gonna Hydro Pump the Talon Flame because screw the Talon Flame. Because I can beat the Hitmon top with my Trevenant. I don't need. I don't need my Trevenant. I don't need my my Mawile. Yeah, you know he's just gonna he's gonna Brave Bird the the mo Melodic, which is why I went for the crunch onto the Talon Flame. Because I figured he's not going to Flare Blitz my Mawile, because I'm going to protect. And my Mawile is a bigger threat to his team, so obviously I'm going to go for that. Um, he goes for Earthquake? Why do you have Earthquake? Come on now. Why are you running Earthquake on a hip on top? That makes no sense. That makes no sense. And you go down. Good. That's what I needed. That's what I needed. I'm so confused. All right, we're gonna bring Trevin in here. This Trevin is my best play to bring in. Not a good health, but oh, Hydra God! No, come on, really, really? Damn it! Okay, I really need to get this trick room up because then I just I straight up lose if I don't. I'm gonna go for the player off onto the the Hydra God. He might might just go for the uh, the flamethrower, which would be really awesome. Which would be really awesome, and I can really take advantage of that. But if he doesn't, ugh, this is gonna be awkward. He goes for the Earth Power. I should have protected. I knew he was gonna attack me. Why did I do that? That was such a bad play. That was such a bad play. Mm. I knew he was gonna go for that too. I even said he was gonna go for the flamethrower, didn't I? Why do I not think sometimes? Why do I not think? I should wake up though. Um, so I'm gonna have to fake out this. I have to kill the Hitmon top. That's my only play right now. I have to fake out the Hitmon top and kill the Hitmon top if I have any chance of surviving this Hydra Dom. I have to. 
have to kill the, I have to kill the hit on top. We're gonna see, guys. We're gonna see if this works. So fake out and horn leech. That should be enough to take out the hit on top, no doubt in my mind. But the only issue is this Hydra gun. Am I gonna be able to take him out with my Scrafty? Like, am I gonna really be able to take a, a Draco Meteor? If he's smart, he'll just sack off his hitmon top and then kill my Scrafty. Oh, this is gonna this is interesting. I don't know how this is gonna end. With me dying, most likely. But fake out goes off, but it does a decent chunk. Flinch, we get the horn leech off. And we do kill. Woo! Okay. What does the Hydragon do? What does the Hydragon do? Does he go for my Scrafty? No. Okay. So I'm not gonna survive that, obviously. But I have Trick Room on my side. I've got Drain Punch. And I have Assault Vest. Do you think we can come back from this? I don't know. Maybe. It'd be kinda nice if we could. I don't know. Oh, man. I really, honestly, I should have protected with that Mawile that turn. Because then I would have Trick Room up. I'd have Mawile. And Mawile beats his last. Oh, my lord! Oh, my god! That did so much more damage than I thought it would. And he goes for Draco. But I'm not surviving this. I'm not surviving the Draco. And that's the problem. Ah! Oh, I lost it at that protect. Wait, what? Oh, it looked like it did stop. <laughs> Damn it, I lost it at that protect. I hate when I do plays like that, because it's just like I could have very easily won that if I just protected, got the trick room up, play rough the the Hydragon, and I would have just won right there. Damn it, that's that that's that's unfortunate when that happens. Either way, thank you guys so much for watching. I really do appreciate it, and I hope to see you guys at the next episode. Peace.